Take a look at problem 2-5. So the automobile traveling along a straight road increases its speed from 30 meters per second to 50 meters per second at a distance of 180 meters. If the acceleration is constant, how much time elapses while the auto moves this distance? So we have constant acceleration, so we know the kinematics will apply. And we're told that it increases the speed from 30 to 50, so we know initial velocity is 30. Let me change the pin. Final velocity is 50. And we're given that it, it does it in a displacement of 180 meters. So right away we're given three kinematic variables, and we are asked for the fourth one, what is time? So I have four kinematic variables. I search through my kinematic equations for the one that has these four variables in it, or in other words, I want the equation that doesn't have acceleration in it. And it looks like I want kinematic equation number two. Displacement is equal to initial velocity plus final velocity divided by two times time. Only true for constant acceleration, but that's all we're dealing with. So we solve this for time, multiply both sides by 2, and then divide both sides by v naught plus v. So we will get that t is equal to 2 delta x divided by v naught plus v. And that will be equal to 2 times 180 divided by 30 plus 50. That will be, what, 3 times 180, 540 divided by 80. Oops, 2 times 180, 360 divided by 80, which will be 4.5 seconds. So that is the time that elapsed while the auto moves this distance.